Hello YouTube, it's Ponce Magnifique with another video. So, I had to go change shirts because uh, it's hot outside. It's burning up out here. And I was sweating profusely up under my arms. I do wonder if there's anything, any such thing as an antiperspirant. I can remember a while back I did a not even a review, but I was talking trash about Native. No, actually giving them very much props about Native, saying that I wasn't sweating, but after a while of wearing it, just about maybe a month ago, that became untrue. Like, I was, I don't know, I was sweating, but then it was a different scent that came off than what the scent was in the deodorant. And it wasn't like it stank or anything like that. It was just that it was just a different scent. So, anyways, I'm gonna do this haul before my neighbors and stuff start coming outside. I try to do an outside haul. So, anyway, get some good lighting and all that great stuff. But let's go. So, I went to Bath and Body Works today. Hey, my belly. Cover up my belly. Woo. So, anyways, here we go. We got Poolside Cabana. There's a sale going on today. For those of you who do not know, the fine fragrance mists are 550 I believe. And they are, I got an additional $30 off $100 purchase, which makes that 30% off, right? So, I don't know what I did with my receipt. It was super long there, though. So, let's see. That was 575 my bad. Not 550 575 for fine fragrance mist. And they are, like I said, you can get a coupon for an additional five dollars off 25 ten dollars off of four i don't know what they got on here but it was thirty dollars off of a hundred which makes these come down to four dollars and thirty cents which was cheaper than what i did with the 25 percent off coupon about a week ago so or no i think that was on the man's actually yeah, it was cheaper than the man's. So anyways, let's get this haul done. So we got Poolside Cabana. And I won't smell these because I'm just going to put these in baskets and I don't want to mess up the priming or, you know, make people think that somebody used it. So we're not going to go there. I'm going to line them up back here until I get finished. Hopefully the sun don't melt them. This is at the beach. And then we got watermelon mojito. So they changed the uh, tips of these now. So they're back gold again. So if you wanted the green, you better get them because they're going back to the gold. I got pink pineapple sunrise, which I told y'all this was thang yang because last year I used a whole bottle at Vegas. So this was a good one. I'm doing a video, hey. Um, I got pastel skies. Most of these I bought because of the uh, packaging. I don't know why my lighting changed. But, whatever. Got sweet pea. Who don't like sweet pea? I hope the lighting doesn't change when y'all see it. Sweet pea. But it looked different to me. I don't know. Maybe the, it's trying to save energy because the sun is shining on the phone. Um, so this is a new one, whipped coconuts milkshake, and this is good. I, I sprayed it while I was in the store. Not this one, but I sprayed one when I was in the store. Vanilla ice cream, toasted coconut, and sugar amber. I think it's the amber in there. I like, I like amber. I got golden sunflower, which is, is a, not an old, or not a new fragrance. It's an OG. Um, well, it's becoming an OG. This is the bomb. Like, it lasts all day. And it doesn't have musk in it as far as the notes go. The notes are sunflower petals, orange flower, and fresh vanilla. But it's musky because I know musk usually tends to make stuff last longer. And this one lasts super long. Like, I can wear that all that That lasts all day for me. And I got Fiji Sunshine, which used to be, what is it? Fiji, Fiji Sunshine Guavatini used to be. This is bomb. It's real fruity. Uh, Sunkissed Guava, Fresh Orange, and Seaside Jasmine. And the jasmine and the orange in here makes it doable for me. Usually I don't do citrus scents because it makes my, I don't know, when I sweat, it just smells awful. To me, it smells awful. I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. I got a poppy, which I love poppy. 
I think it does great for the baskets because even though it's like a pink or a peachy color or whatever color this is, it looks good with red too. Like if you put a red, if you put this in a red, a basket with red stuff, you could. Um, I got groovy watermelon, which smells familiar, and I'm not sure which one it smells like, but it smells very familiar. Juicy pink watermelon, sugar strawberry blossoms, and lime zest. This is a dupe for something, but I don't know which one. Or a repackage, whatever. Gingham Love. Good one. Good one, good one, good one. That one's good. And then I got Beautiful Day. And I really got this one because of the packaging. I love the packaging on this one. Then I got Love Always Wins. Which, again, the packaging here is supreme. Love it. And I think they changed the, uh, what you call it, the makeup of that one. I don't know what they did to it, but this is Sunset Glow. Good old Sunset Glow. And they make this look like it's fruity, but I don't know if this is a fruity scent or not. Nah, it's fr uh, fresh coconut, sparkling cherry, seltzer, creamy moonflower, and caramelized vanilla. So, yeah, I think this is a vanilla-based scent, so I don't... It looks fruity, though, don't it, with the pink color? But whatever. And then I got another sparkling orange spritz. Packaging. Awesome. Amazing. And then, y'all know I had to go get some more of these. Because they still buy one, get one free. So it ended up being about $13 a piece. The good old sweet tea and lemonade. I absolutely love this candle. I can smell it all day. Mm, mm, mm. I got two of these. So, it is the holiday. I feel bad that the girls had to work today all to deal with my crazy self coming in. Buying up stuff that I already got 18 of. <laughs> um, but I got, two, I got two of those. So, let's see the other one. And that is all. I got the good old um, semi-annual sale reminder. Get, get there next week y'all they say starts june 3rd be watching out because online you know they be having i need to fix my email my regular email because i'm not gonna be getting the darn emails if i don't fix it i don't know what's wrong with it it just it just stopped working because it was full so now it won't take nothing like i can't get any emails even if i clean it out it don't no emails come so I don't know what the trick is, but I'm getting annoyed by it. And I don't really want to have to change my email because that's like changing your phone number. So the only way I can get around that is probably to just delete all the emails. And I don't know if I can be able to do that because I'd be needing, I, you know, I keep my emails because I need them for whatever. And I don't know if you archive them, if they take away from your inbox or not. But anyways, that's my haul for the day. The neighbor's getting ready to barbecue, so it's about to get loud and holiday-ish in the hood so thank y'all for coming to watch the video i hope y'all having a good day enjoy the sunshine because y'all know it's limited thank y'all bye bye